You can use Das Modeling Clay and Das Idea Mix to create marble-like jewels. Every piece will be unique. The result will surprise you, not only because your jewels will seem made of real marble, but also because of how natural they are to the touch. Moreover, using Das, your jewels will weigh much less than those made of glass or natural stones. It's really easy. We'll use some practical metal molds. So, let's get started. To make geometric jewels, you need half a kilo of Das white modeling clay, Das idea mix in different colors, scissors, Das professional rolling pin, Das metal molds, Das wooden cutters, Das steel spatulas, toothpicks, a polystyrene support, Vernie Das professional vitrifying varnish plus brush. Start rolling out half a kilo of Das white clay using the rolling pin without rings. Choose at least two colors of Das Idea Mix marbling clay. In this case, we have chosen Port Oro Black and Verona Red. Place a few portions on various spots of half of the sheet. The amount should be approximately 20% compared to the Das white clay. Use the steel spatula to cut off long strips from the sides. Arrange them randomly on the sheet and roll out using the roll-in with the 5mm rings. Now we have a marble-like sheet with an elongated shape and marble veins running lengthwise. Now take one or more metal moulds. In this case, we'll use a large round mould. Dip the base in water to make it easier to die-cut the clay by pressing on the chosen area. Remove the round shape and die-cut it with a smaller mould, for example, a round one. You can use the excess clay to make other jewels. Use a moist and toothpick to make a hole from side to side in the fresh shapes. Now place them vertically on the polystyrene support to air dry. To create small single colour round or oval beads, all you have to do is roll up a little portion of Das Idea Mix between the palms of your slightly damp hands until you get the shape you want. Gently make a hole using a wet toothpick and place it on the polystyrene support to dry. You can even use the ruler and steel spatula to cut out square and rectangular shapes, which you can die cut. Use a damp toothpick to make a hole and leave the shapes to dry with the other beads. Remember to store any excess product in its airtight container to keep it fresh for future use. Once all the beads are completely air dried, apply one or more coats of Vernidas Professional Protective and Glazin Vitrifying Varnish to enhance the marble effect. By the way, did you know that our varnish is dermatologically tested? Once the varnish is dry, your beads will be ready for threading. You can use cords, ribbons, fish hooks, fasteners, and you can match them or interchange them as you like. Easy, right? It takes only a few simple steps to make jewelry sets that are so beautiful that everyone will want them.